Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. In Access, when you want to pull specific records from a table based on the values in a specified query field, you have to enter a criteria against which to match that field. For example, let's say we wanted to see employees that lived in a specific region or state. To set the criteria, first off, click into the criteria row underneath the column by which you would like to restrict the data that is pulled. You can then type in the criteria needed. So in this case, let's say WA for Washington. When you leave the field, notice it put double quotes around it here. That's because it's comparing region to the text value of WA, since region is a text value. If you don't type in the exact correct syntax, Access will usually clean up after you and put in the correct information. So it's just always looking out for you here. So here we're going to compare the region to the text value WA, which we can see in the double quotes and it will then show the first name and last name of employees who are in that region. To run the query and view the result set, click the red exclamation point. So here are our employees that live in Washington. You may then switch back to query design view or save the query and close it if you would prefer. One thing to note about comparison values is that if you're comparing text values, you'll use double quotes. If you're comparing dates, those should be surrounded in pound signs. If you're making a reference in a comparison to a field value, those will be enclosed in brackets. Any number is just that, only a number. They need no kind of special indicator. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.